Hello Waterstones, I'm Martha Holmes. I'm one of the authors of The Life Book and series producer of the Life television series that's going out at the moment. And I'm Mike Gunton. I'm also one of the authors of the book and I'm the executive editor of the series that's going out at the moment. A real battle also. Everybody wanted to put their favourites in and there are some real favourites and the passion and the excitement of the people who wrote these, you can tell, they absolutely loved being with these animals and telling those stories. And I think that really comes through in the book. One of the best moments for me or trips for me on making the life series and writing about it was um, in Antarctica trying to film killer whales hunting seals on ice floes. No one had cracked this before and I was lucky enough to go down on quite a long shoot with the Royal Navy. We'd also chartered a vessel, a yacht, that we had another film crew on so there were, it was a kind of pincer attack. Um, the smaller yacht going for underwater and water level shots and I was working with the Royal Navy to get the aerial shots, the helicopter shots from the air. And it was just an amazing experience to be down there for five weeks um, searching for, um, for killer whales, hunting seals, which is slightly needle in a haystack stuff. Uh, we were very lucky on two days that the boats happened to be incredibly close together. We were working in, in um, an inlet and we came across killer whales. So not only the whales were there, they were hunting and the boats were at the same time. So we did manage to get the sequence which was fantastic, and that is written about in the, and the, the, the whale behaviour is written about in the book. I think one of the other things that's amazing about um, the experience of working on this series and is reflected in the book is that uh, as well as the amazing detailed stories and amazing intimate stories that we were able to witness when the animals were behaving, we also were able to experience some of the, wonder, the great natural wonders of the world. And one of the things that I did on my, uh, on my filming experiences is I went over to Mexico and was able to film the monarch butterfly um, hibernation in the mountains up in the Sierra Madres and the, the days when they start to emerge from their hibernation and, and, and start to flutter down from the trees. And it, it's almost indescribable because it is like being in a surreal world because the, the air is just full of these butterflies. We're not talking thousands, we're not talking hundreds of thousands, we're talking millions of these butterflies, huge orange butterflies. And it's not just the beautiful imagery of it, but it's the sound, because all these millions and millions of wings just fluttering, it just creates this extraordinary atmosphere. And I said, it's, as I said, it's almost like being in an in a, in a Alice in Wonderland world. And I, I will never forget it. And I'd seen it before, I'd seen stills of it, but I'd, I'd never imagined how, what an experience it would be. And, and that again is written about in the book.